Having your social media bio page with many different links and having the ability to track them is super important these days in social media and content creation. But there are two platforms out there right now competing and today we're going to put them head to head to see which is better. So stick around because today we're comparing PrimeLink with Rebrandly. So first, let's talk links and analytics. We can see here with Rebrandly, it does have all of our links right here. And if we want to create a new link, we just press the new link button. It's going to give us a link pretty much instantly. However, the problem I find with Rebrandly is the analytics. There's actually a massive paywall before you can see any analytics on your links. You can only see the amount it's been clicked. You can't see location or anything like that. Whereas if we go over to Prime Link, the other contender here in this video, we can see that yes, we would have our links down here based on the most recent ones that we've made, which is incredibly useful. We're also going to have an exact location from where those links were clicked. You can see here on the right hand side, and we're going to get a graph here showing basically how much our links are being clicked and whether our campaigns, if we are running campaigns with links, are working effectively. If this goes up, obviously our campaign's doing really well or our content's doing really well and people are going onto our bio page. Uh, but yeah, we can see here on the side, we do have the links and then we have the link clicks right right here on the left hand side. But what about bio pages? Because this is a massive, massive part of your social media presence. And it's always good to have a good intuitive platform that can help you create the perfect bio page. So here we can see with Rebrandly, a very simple preview section on the right hand side of what our link page will look like and some simple but effective ways you can edit those links and edit the titles. Now this is okay for a basic user, I guess. But if you're an influencer with a brand or you're trying to put any kind of colors or branding or customization, this is incredibly limited. Now we could change the background of this if we want to something a little bit different and that's fine. But let's talk about Prime Link because Prime Link have actually done something here that are completely changing the game, allowing you to customize your page in a way that is super beneficial to anyone with a brand or brand colors. To access this, all you got to do is on the Prime Link dashboard, go over to the left hand side and click bio pages. Then we can have multiple bio pages here. If you're on the free subscription, you can have one and that's absolutely perfect. Obviously, most people will just want one, but we can see here that we have all of our links and we can actually edit them and customize them very, very effectively. You can see the preview on the right hand side here is just so much better. The background is animated. We've got logos in here. We can even hover over the text right here and see that it is animated as well. And this in itself as customization is really, really easy to do. In fact, let me just show you how easy this is. If we just click on one of these links here, we can add an emoji we can add an image, we can change the text if we want, and we can change the link. And we can even select if it wants to open a new window if that link is clicked. And then we have the animation option where we can make it shake, scale, jello, vibrate, or wobble. So many, many different options here to customize our link page. And if we go to advanced options, we can actually customize this even more here. That can include geo-targeting, language targeting, and you can even schedule when this link is working or when this link is not on the link page. So if you're running a campaign or a bonus or some kind of affiliate code on your link page, then you can actually have that set to run at certain days of the week, or you could set it to run throughout a campaign period. When that campaign ends, it would automatically leave the page. This is just super easy. And it's something I think a lot of these other link pages and platforms are missing. So here we have the Rebrandly link page. Okay, I've done a bit of customization on this and we have the Prime link. Let's see what this looks like on the link page itself. So this would be the prime link one, we can see that everything is here as I have tried to make it. And we can see we've got TikTok, YouTube, X right here as logos next to my name. And we can see that we can do check out our website, we can book a call here, and we can integrate this with other apps as well. Now you can do similar things here on Rebrandly, but you can see here the customization, the presentation, and just the general platform in itself feels like it's been stripped down from what it could be in terms of customization, and just getting your brand right. So really these guys offer you a background, they offer you a profile picture, an at, and then basically any links here that you want to list. And that might be okay. But if you want something that's a little bit more branded towards you, like you can see here, then yes, I would say Prime Link is the winner. Now let's talk about pricing because that's what's important to get the most out of both of these platforms. So Prime Link, they do have a fantastic free tier here. Okay, so you can do 50 short links, 1000 clicks per month, data retention for 30 days on your analytics, and you get one bio page, one QR 
QR code and many more things here completely for free. But if you did want to upgrade and get infinite short links, infinite link clicks and a year's analytics data here, then it's simply $9 a month. That is ridiculously cheap for what you're getting. And again, the customization here you can get from this is fantastic. And not to mention if you wanted multiple bio pages for different brands that you control, you can do all of this in one account on that $9 a month subscription where you could have 10 of your different accounts, whether it's e-commerce, right? Whether you're on Coursera selling courses or something like this, maybe you've got a pottery shop with its own social media page, right? What you can do here is get separate bio pages for each of those and have it very, very easily organized in the Prime Link dashboard. Now, what about Rebrandly? So Rebrandly is eight bucks a month. Okay. You get two 250 branded links and 10,000 tracked links. So that's fine. But when you're talking about the value that you're paying for here, right? This is basically just links. Okay. You're getting links. And if you want those links on a, a link page, you put them on a link page and that's what you're getting here, right? But if we're talking about prime link, the customization that you get from this is ridiculous. You're going to get those links. You're going to get the bio page with way further along customization with animations, branding, different button sizes. You guys have seen this right from this it's ridiculously good so when we are talking about prime link in terms of value it's nine bucks a month for that lowest tier subscription but you're getting so much more for that extra dollar and that is why i use prime link more than anything another thing to note here guys on the free subscription is rebrandly won't actually give you any analytics if we go to reports here right full account reports it's behind a paywall right it's completely behind a paywall you can't see anything whereas if we go over to the dashboard on prime link here guys i just want to show you that yeah you can see everything and if we did want some more data we go down to links here on the dashboard again super intuitive everything's labeled you know where to go on this site but if we want to get to analytics and really expand this guys we will go to the statistics and again everything super intuitive very very easy to really know where you're going on this we can see here yes we do have our links our clicks and then we actually have a visitor map to show geolocation now this on rebrandly you're actually gonna have to pay massive amounts just to get any kind of data besides the amount of time your link was clicked. So in terms of analytics, I would say Prime Link massively ahead on that front as well. So in total, guys, which one would you say is the better kind of link gallery or link page platform out there or even link shortener, right? I would say in terms of link shortening, yeah, maybe they're a little bit equal there. I prefer Prime Link because you just have a much simpler process and it's easier to use. But in terms of link pages, as you can see here, well, this is the Prime Link one, okay? And it, the link is super simple as well. Okay, you've got Prime Link slash Hamilton, super simple. And if we go to Rebrandly, this is what Rebrandly looks like. Now, there's a bit of customization you can do here on colors, but overall, I think the winner is clear and I will be sticking with Prime Link from now on. So overall, Rebrandly versus Prime Link. Prime Link is definitely going to be the winner here. Uh, hopefully I have proved this to you here today and hopefully I have given you some value. If you are looking for that perfect bio link page, definitely check out Prime Link in the description. But that is going to be the video. If you did enjoy it, drop a like, leave a comment and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.